In this tutorial, we will write a Java program to count the number of vowels constants in a sentence. So uh, I have already created the object uh, reader of the scanner class. So uh, let's read it, uh, read a sentence from user. Enter a sentence, user will enter the sentence and we read it into our string variable called sentence equals to reader dot next line and uh, I will uh, convert my sentence uh, into uh, lower case because just in case there are some uh, upper case letters as well so I want to convert all of them into lower case okay and I want to create integer data type of uh, vowels equals to zero and cons consonants equals to zero and I also want to uh, check digits as well equals to zero and I also want to check spaces white spaces also so they are also equals to zero so uh, we start a for loop okay and uh, we start from integer i equals to zero and while i is less than sentence dot length and uh, we increase i by one okay and then uh, uh, basically we take one character at, the, at a time so we create a character uh, character data type of c equals to sentence dot character at at zero at not zero but i okay and now if we say if uh, i not i but if c uh, is equals to a or or c equals to uh, e or c equals to i or c equals to I'm sorry, this is equals to something like if c equals to o or c equals to um, u. If c uh, meets any of these conditions, then I increase basically our uh, vowels by 1. Else if, else if my uh, c is greater or equals to a and my c is less than equals to z then i increase my cons consonants by one else if my c is greater than equals to zero and c is less than equals to uh, nine then I increase my digits by 1. Else if my C is equals to white space, then I increase my uh, spaces by 1. Okay. So this loop will end over here. And finally, uh, we print them. So we print uh, our vowels or vowels equals to vowels okay and and uh, print or consonants equals to hey, consonants and print digits are digits and finally uh, spaces equals uh, spaces so far so good uh, let's run it and see error error over here okay so I have given and instead of uh, and basically operator so there was this mistake and an other error um, cannot find symbol okay so a uh, vowel has a v simal okay and this also has c simal 
V small, this is D small, and this has S small. Okay, these all are small characters. Okay, let's give this also small. This is also small. Okay, so far so good. Um, I'm sorry. Basically, C. Okay. There we go. So enter a sentence. So I say uh, Java is a uh, hundred times better than uh, C plus plus. So if I say this, okay, and you see, we have total of eight vowels. So if you see one vowels, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we have eight vowels. And three digits, one zero zero three digits, and spaces are six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six spaces, and uh, that's it. And sixteen. Rest of the uh, uh, consonants. So uh, this works, which is beautiful. So uh, what we are doing is, uh, we have created a scanner object which will help us reading um, from the user. We have given message to the user to enter a sentence. User will enter the sentence. We are reading it by reader dot next line and storing into a string variable called sentence. And we are converting all of uh, characters in our sentence to lower case, just in case if our uh, sentences are upper case as well, because we don't want to create uh, upper uh, uh, other conditions for upper case as well. If you see right over here, I have just created conditions for. Uh, a lower case so what i've done is i have uh, converted all of them into lower case and then only condition for lower cases okay and then i have created variables for um, everything i want to uh, count vowels consonants digits and spaces and i am running a loop and in this loop basically i am starting from zero index up to the length of the string and i'm taking one character at a time and i am checking if c uh, or character is equals to a e i o u any of these uh, characters then which means it's a vowel so I increase vowel by one and in a, if uh, these conditions do not match then I see if it is uh, between a and z and if it is I increase by uh, consonants and now if uh, you see there are some uh, uh, a e i o u all of these uh, vowels in uh, between a and z here as well but the thing is that if uh, our character were, was any vowel this condition would have run and uh, the code will not wouldn't, wouldn't even have come over here so uh, the thing is that uh, even if uh, we have so many uh, vowels between a and z but it doesn't matter because we have already a uh, condition for them uh, in this if okay so uh, after constants we are checking if uh, the character is from 0 to 9 and if it is we are increasing uh, our digits by 1 and if it sees equals to a white space, then we are uh, increasing spaces by one. And finally, we are printing all of them. So uh, that's it with this tutorial. And please subscribe my YouTube channel and I'll see you in next tutorial.